Dear friends, now I am going to show you a magic trick. When I like it, this LED starts to glow. Otherwise, it does not glow with any other gesture. In this video, I will show you how you can implement the power of AI on your Arduino and it is easier than you think. This is the Husky Lens. It is an AI powered visual sensor module. I have a dedicated video on its use and getting started. You can find the link in the video description. This is very easy to use with any microcontroller and it has built in algorithms to recognize faces, objects, colors, lines, QR codes, etc. I will show you how to use it to detect any object and control a GPIO pin of an Arduino. At first, I have to use this module in learning mode. This module has a lot of functions and I will try to show you in an easier way. I am using a power bank and a micro USB cable to power this module. I have chosen this small blue car as the object it will learn. Now I am going to object tracking mode. I have to place the object inside the yellow box. Pressing the right upper button forgets the previously memorized object. Now pressing it once to start learning. It will learn the object from different angles and dimensions. It will take some time. The object detection depends on proper learning. When learning is completed, the yellow box turns green and shows the object ID, which is 1. We will need this object ID for coding. You can use advanced option of object tracking mode for more accurate learning. Now I have to select the communication protocol to connect to Arduino. I am using serial communication at 9600. Going to general setting then protocol type, then serial 9600. You can use an Arduino Nano or Arduino Uno. I am using a Nano board. Program Arduino using the Arduino IDE. The code link is in the video description. The coding is very simple. Husky Lens is connected via software serial to digital pin 10 and 11. And the LED is connected to digital pin 13. Now, when the Husky Lens detects object ID 1, the LED will go. The connector cables comes with Husky Lens. I am adding some hookup wires for use on the breadboard. The red wire will be connected to the 5 volt positive of the Arduino and the black wire to GND. The green wire from the Husky lens will connect to Arduino digital pin 10 and the blue wire will be connected to digital pin 11. Connecting the LED positive to digital pin 13 and LED negative to GND using this yellow wire. No extra power source is needed for the Husky Lens. Just connect this 4 pin cable. The connection is completed. I am using a power bank to turn the Arduino. All the works is done. It is time to see the result. As you can see, it is detecting the car and showing ID1 on the LCD and then the LED is glowing. Testing from different angles. Putting a completely different object, 
it is not detecting i am going to complicate its work for testing i am using an almost identical car with different colors let's see what it can do it is not detecting the red car as object 1 but sometimes it gets confused if i choose color detection mode it shows completely different ids for different colors car you can use your hand gesture as an object when it is learning and then it will work with hand gesture i hope this video will be helpful if you are trying to make an ai based arduino project thank you for watching see you soon in the next video